everyone my name is mini seti i hope you all are staying healthy today we are going to talk about circular flow of income in two three and four sector economics firstly we talk about circular flow of income in two sector economy without saving an investment here we have only two sector first is household sector other one is business firms household sectors are those sector who give their factor services to business firm household sectors are those sector who give their uh, factor services to business firms and household sector can give their factor service in form of uh, labor land capital or enterprise means sometime household sector work as a labor in business firm uh, sometime they give their land to business firms on rent sometime they give their money or we can say that sometime they give their capital to business firm for use and sometime they give their factor service in form of enterprise you can see here flow of factor services is going from household sector to business firm means household sector give their uh, factor services to business firms when household sector give their factor services to business firm in return they receive factor payment if household sector give their factor service in form of labor then household sector receive wage if household sector give their factor service in form of land then household sector receive rent if household sector give their factor service in form of capital then they receive interest if the household sector give their factor service in form of enterprise then they receive profit so we can say that household sector give their factor services to business firm in form of labor land capital enterprise and in return they receive factor payment in form of wage rent interest and profit okay and second thing about household is that they buy goods and services from farms or we can say that farms provide goods and services to household sector you can see here flow of goods and services is going from farms to household sector and when farms provide goods and services to household sector in return household sector make payment for goods and services you can see here payment of goods and services is going from household sector to farms now we will see circular flow of income in two sector economy me with the saving and investment as we all know there are so many financial institution in economy uh, for example banks where household sector deposit their saving and business firm borrow this money from financial institution for investment purpose uh, so we can say that saving of household sector generate investment in economy in this figure everything is same as we earlier discussed new thing we add here saving financial sector and investment you can see here saving of household sector is going in financial sector and financial sector give this money to business firm for investment purpose and saving without a financial institution work as a leakage saving without financial institution work as a leakage because you are not using your money for any purpose you just keep it on the other hand saving with the financial institution generate investment and investment is injection for our economy as we all know increase in investment leads to increase in national income now we will see circular flow of income in three sector economy here apart from including household and firms we also include government in this figure everything is same as we earlier discussed only new thing we add here is government firstly we see relation between household sector and government government make transfer payment and factor payment to household sector government make factor payment and transfer payment to household sector a uh, factor payment mean for example a person from household sector work as a government employees then he receive wages and salary from government so government make factor payment to household sector plus government make transfer payment to household sector transfer payment means government gave household sector to uh, scholarship uh, pension or unemployment allowance in return household sector gave taxes to government now we will see relation between government and firms government purchase goods of firm sometime government purchase goods and services from firms and sometime government give subsidies to firms subsidies means sometime government give financial help to firms in return firms pay taxes to government
Now we will see circular flow of income in four sector economy or we can say that open economy. Here apart from including household sector, government and firm, we also include foreign sector. Here everything is same as we earlier discussed. New thing we add here is foreign sector. Firstly, we see relation between household sector and foreign sector. Household sector receive foreign remittance from foreign sector. Household sector receive foreign remittance from foreign sector. Foreign remittance means if you are related from foreign is sending you money it's called foreign remittance and household sector make payment for import to foreign sector sometimes household sector do import and they have to make payment for their import now we see relationship between foreign sector and firms. Firm also make payment for import to foreign sector. Sometimes firm also do import of goods and services, tools, equipment for their business purpose. Then they make payment to uh, foreign sector for their import. And firm receive money from foreign sector through their export. Means sometimes firm do export of goods and services in foreign sector and in return they receive money from foreign sector. sector. It's called receipt for export. This is all about uh, circular flow of income in uh, 2, 3 and 4 sector economy. I think you got it and thank you so much for watching this video. Bye, take care.